Well, good afternoon. I'm George Latimer, Westchester County Executive, and I'm here with uh, individuals that are all together involved in a terrific program that's going to be uh, with us tomorrow, the City of Science program, which we're very excited at here at the Westchester County Center. Uh, in a couple of minutes, you're going to hear from Jane Solnick, who is uh, Director of Public Affairs for the region for Con Edison, which is the, uh, the main sponsor of this event, along with uh, the County and Parks Department and so forth. And then the terrific mayor of White Plains, Tom Roach, will be speaking. Ben Boykin, who chairs the Westchester County Board of Legislators, who is here. He's joined, by the way, by his colleague, Mary Jane Shimsky, County Legislator and Majority Whip. Uh, we also have with us uh, uh, Pat Keegan, who is uh, uh, the district uh, manager for our terrific uh, representative, Nita Lowy, in Congress. And we have Sergio Serrato, who's with us here, representing State Senator Andre Stewart Cousins, who leads the New York State Senate. So uh, we have quite a lot of commitment here on the government side and on the private sector side uh, to the success of this program tomorrow. We're all very excited that uh, the Westchester County Center has an opportunity to host one of these events. Mm -hmm. They have been hosted in other parts of the region, in the five boroughs, at a variety of colleges and other settings. And so to bring it here to, to Tom Roach's city and to our building uh, gives us a chance in Westchester County to have access to really this terrific program. Uh, this program highlights science, technology, engineering, mathematics, all the courses that I didn't do well in <laughs> when I was in high school and college. But all the courses that represent the future technologies and where jobs are coming uh, for young people today in an area that uh, is growing by uh, technological leaps and bounds. And so the exhibits that we'll see here and different people talk a little bit more about it will put a fun emphasis on science and I think that's an important element of it. And for this country to advance, we need to have young people interested in science and technology and engineering and math uh, as part of these different programs. Uh, the exhibits are something like you haven't seen before here in Westchester County. And again, we're very flattered that uh, the City of Science organization chose to put one of these here for uh, tomorrow. It's an opportunity to see very large exhibits and also hands-on experiences, learn by doing, which oftentimes is how young people get turned on to science and the different other categories we're dealing with. You'll have a team of experts here, people who are science ambassadors, who are very well versed in, in not only the activity that you're doing, but can tie it to the scientific principle behind it. I don't want to take all the fun out of it, but so that it's not just a fun experience, but a fun and a learning experience. And, uh, and this is really part of the overall STEM program that many of our, our schools are emphasizing now. I've seen it in various uh, local public schools as they try to emphasize this, uh, but this is separate and distinct from that and I think a terrific way uh, to spend uh, Saturday. Um, some of the exhibit highlights is a 20-foot pendulum wave which will uh, display wave theory. Another thing I didn't quite grasp when I sat in physics class with Mr. Russell back in 11th grade, uh, and they have 15 LED pendulums swinging in and out of order. There's a 25-foot tall seismic accelerator. As you can see, I'm reading from a script. Uh, there's going to be an opportunity to play tug of war on wheels and learn about Newton's third law. This assumes you know Newton's first and second law. And uh, you're also going to have other opportunities, uh, most of which uh, just will be fun, but also educational and learning. So we're very happy to be a part of this with Westchester County, that again, it's here in White Plains and it's here uh, through the cooperation with Con Edison. So let me introduce Jane Solnick, who um, is Director of uh, Public Affairs for the region of Con Edison and a strong supporter of programs like this across Westchester. Jane. Thank you, George. Con Edison has been supporting a number of STEM and science efforts throughout the county with our strategic partners. So we are thrilled that Con Edison, in partnership with Westchester County and with George Latimer, can bring City of Science here to the county center for all the residents in Westchester County. I have to tell you that all the people that George had mentioned who are up here with us today have been great supporters to us in getting the word out about this program, and we expect a great day tomorrow, and we're looking to inspire those young minds to move ahead in the science field, and so we welcome you all to join us. Thank you. Thank you, Jane. Our next speaker is Tracy Day, who is the uh, founder and the CEO of Science City, City Science. Thanks, George. Uh, so yeah, I, I uh, just by way of brief introduction, uh, again, my name is Tracy Day, and I'm the co-founder of the World Science Festival with the physicist and author Brian Green. And just to give a little bit of background, um, you know, we thought science was getting increasingly siloed. 
It was something that, to George's point, if you weren't going into science, somewhere along the way you thought it got a little boring. And that was a shame. And we wanted to change that. So we wanted to bring programming to a general audience of all ages to try to bring the fun and the creativity and the storytelling back to science. So we're now going into our 11th year. Uh, we've launched festivals in Manhattan. And thanks to the inspiration of Con Edison, we took these major programs and brought them out to the boroughs of New York and now to Westchester County. And we could not be more delighted about that. So we hope to see eyes light up. We hope to see enthusiasm among young children and families and teachers and all members of the community. So again, I really just want to thank Con Edison. I want to thank George Latimer. I want to thank Mayor Roach, who you'll hear from in just a moment. And uh, come tomorrow. It starts at 10 o'clock. And uh, have a blast. Thank you, Tracy. My partner in county government, uh, the Westchester County Board of Legislators, working with the executive branch, is led by our chairman, who is also White Plains resident, the Honorable Ben Boykin. Thank you. And it is great that Westchester County is getting its chance to host the STEM uh, uh, conference that will be held tomorrow. Science, technology, engineering, math. Uh, you're going to see things that, you know, will wow you. Probably will find the next um, Thomas Edison. Maybe um, Albert Einstein. You know, the young minds get, getting creative, working in these areas. Also, you know, we've got the hopefully the biotech uh, center coming in Westchester that is really jobs for the future. Uh, I'm quite sure that the things that you'll see tomorrow are going to be much better than the things I did when I was a youth and going to those science fairs, building the periscopes and building these little wheels that uh, you had to put batteries on and hopefully they would operate. But you're going to see the future tomorrow. And so we're very pleased that the county has been able to partner with Con Ed to bring this uh, to the county center. We're also joined uh, by the commissioner of our parks and recreation. I think she's here, uh, Kathleen O'Connor. Yeah, so there she is. And also, welcome. We look forward to a great day tomorrow. And I understand thousands of people have already signed up to come to see this, uh, these outstanding exhibits tomorrow. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ben. Next, the mayor of the city of White Plains, Tom Roach. Okay, thank you, George, and uh, hello, everyone. I want to thank the county for making their beautiful facility available to host this event, and I want to thank Con Ed um, for bringing it. When Jane sent me the information and said, can I share it, I was so excited personally by it, um, and I put it out on my own social media, uh, and um, big, huge response of, like, ex ex people were ecstatic about it, and they were alerting each other to it, and uh, so I think we're going to have a great turnout. I think uh, science and math are things that people and kids can sometimes roll their eyes at. It doesn't sound like fun. And I think it's so important to get young people in an environment where they can see what science and math can do. Um, and, and then that it's worth the work to get there. And there are young people for whom this is what they love. I was just talking to the school superintendent. I think he told me there's something called multivariant or a calculus that they're teaching at the high school now. They have some kids that are so into it. And I was like, it sounds like the calculus is moving, and it's scary enough when it stays in one place. But, um, but we have those kids, and um, you need to get them in an environment where they can be exposed to things that they may wanna, want to do. So um, I want to, again, thank Con Ed. Um, Con Ed is also a big supporter of uh, and participant in the um, engineering expo that's held at White Plains High School every year that people come from around the region to, and it's pretty remarkable. So uh, this is just one more way to get things in front of kids and have a good time doing so. So thank you. Our Commissioner of Parks, Recreation, and Conservation, Kathy O'Connor. Good afternoon, everybody. We're so excited to be able to offer this program to the public. Uh, working with Con Ed, Jane Solnick, Jane and I have done a lot of programs together, and when she asked me not a long time ago if there was a possibility of fitting into uh, the county center schedule, I was so happy to see that we were able to wedge it in in between lots of other things going on. What's exciting is that it shows the versatility of this building. Uh, we go from the reptile show to, uh, to basketball games to now this is a whole new genre that we have never been involved with before. So with the City of Science, Con Ed, K 
County Executive and everyone else, Mayor Roach, we're very excited to be here and looking forward to tomorrow. I think it's really important to mention this is a free program free, which is just <laughs> exceptional in this day and age to be able to come into the building and, and be able to experience what they're going to experience at no cost. So we're very excited. The weather looks better than it's been, so we're excited about that too. But thank you very much to Con Ed, City of Science, County Executive, Latimer, and everybody else that's involved. Thank you.